Hi, my name is Bianca. Hey everyone, today I'm going to be doing a quick swatch video and review video of the new Huda, Huda, whatever you call it, beauty palette. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just go in with the swatches first and then I'll give like my little mini review towards the end. So first you get this big old mirror here and then you get, how many, how many did we say? 18. We get 18 shadows um, and they're really pretty colors. I just love how they look and I love like these purpley shades. But I'm going to swatch them and I have some issues with some of the shades and I'll show you guys which ones they are. Okay, so the first shade is Desert Sand. This one is called Musk. There's Desert Sand and then this one's Musk. This one's Eden. This one's Eden. This one's Amber. Okay, that one's Amber. This one I have no idea how to pronounce it. It's O-U-D. Ode? Something like that. That one's Ode and they're all crooked. Okay, this next one's Blood Moon. And it's like super silky and soft. I like it. This one's Blood Moon. This one's Celestial. This one's Celestial. This one's Nefertiti. <laughs> okay, I don't know how you pronounce it, but it says Nefertiti. It's all dusty and powdery looking. This next one's called Twilight. This one's Twilight. <laughs> okay, this next one is called uh, Amethyst. Swatch is really bad. Or maybe it's just me. It's probably just me. This next one is Royal. Okay, this one's Royal. <laughs> Swatches are really bad. Oh my god, I can't with myself. This next shade is called Retrograde. Okay, that one swatches bad. Retrograde sucks. Okay, this one is Cashmere. Ugh, saw that weird. This one's Cashmere. That one's Cashmere. This one's Angelic. That's Angelic. Okay, this next one is Cosmo. So I'm trying to swatch this and it's like, I don't even know. Yeah, so this one's Cosmo and it's super chunky, chunky copper glitter with like red glitter. And I'm gonna swatch it and let's see how it looks. All right, let's do right there. Oh, it's falling down. Oh, yes. Hmm. Yeah, that one sucks. Like, I feel like I just used the whole pan and all this chunkiness just came out and it wasn't that good. But I feel like if you mix it with some type of like glitter glue, maybe it'll be better. But this one sucks. I actually have it on my eyes. Right there. And right there, and this one I feel like already came off a little bit, and it makes me kind of sad. This next one is called Turkish Delight, and that one's really pretty. Turkish Delight. This next one is called Saffron, that one right there. That one's Saffron. This next one is called Blazing, and that's the last shade. Okay, so these swatches suck, but the first shade is called Desert Sand. And this one is Musk. This next one is Eden. This one is Amber. Then this one is O-U-D. And then this next one is Blood Moon. Right there. The swatches suck. I'm sorry. Here's Celestial. Then we have Nefertiti. <laughs> Go back. <laughs> and then we have uh, Twilight. And then this one is Amethyst. Then we have Royal. And then this one's called Retrograde. And that one is called Cashmere. One? This one's Cashmere. This one's Angelic. This one is Cosmo. It's the one that's super flaky and it's not that good. And then this one is Turkish Delight. The next one is, this one's Saffron. And then that one's Blazing. Okay, so this is the palette that I used today for my eyes. And I feel like I like the palette, but just that, that Cosmo shade, the one that's like glittery, um, copper, red, glitters sucks like well <laughs> it sucks without like a mixing medium or without like a glitter glue maybe just because I did put um just eye primer and then that was it and it's that shade right here so it looks pretty but then this one I feel like has less and it just kind of fell off throughout the day so that's the only complaint I have um if you can look closely to it it just looks super flaky and like not that good um, like just tapping your fingers to it, it's like, whoa, it's just a ton of like crumbly, flaky product, and so I don't really like that shade. 
And then this one I really like a lot, but also like when I put my brush in it, I feel like 10 pounds of eyeshadow just falls off. So I don't really like that. But besides that, this is a really nice palette and I love all the shades that it comes with. I feel like they're really pretty. And besides those, you know, two shades that I feel like I have issues with, I like it a lot and I've been grabbing it like every day to do my makeup lately. So I like it. Is it worth 65 bucks? Mm, for the colors, yeah, but uh, I don't really like those two shades. So I don't really know. I, I feel like... I feel like the quality isn't as good as I would expect it to be for that price. But I mean, if you like makeup and you like colorful palettes, if you like makeup and you like colorful palettes, then might as well why not add it to your collection. But if you were on the fence about it, I just say just don't get it. It's not worth the 65, especially for those shades. A lot of them are like crumbly. So, okay, that is it for my video. Thanks so much for watching. I'm sorry the swatches really suck. Um, I tried my best, but um, please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you again next time. Thank you.